Hey guys, welcome to Artist Corner. Today I'm going to be drawing Colossus from the X-Men. Uh, I drew this picture for a friend of mine. It was his birthday and Colossus is his uh, favorite superhero. So, uh, or one of them, so I decided to draw this. This was one of my favorite things about the Deadpool movie. And I've been waiting to actually, I'm not a huge X-Men fan as I may have mentioned in any of my X-Men related videos on my D3 Media channel, but um, I do like a lot of the individual characters. I'm not a huge fan of them as a whole, but some of the individual characters I like, and Colossus is one of them. I, I like his gentle giant approach. I love his, uh, you know, how he's uh, such a nice guy, but he's this huge hulking like uh, guy. He's just, he's, and he's a really cool design. I love that red and yellow 90s X-Men suit. Um, he, it's a lot of fun, and it was a lot of fun to draw him because he's a metal character, and I, I thought it would pose a fun challenge for me. The only thing that I'm really upset with myself about with this drawing is that if you look at it, um, his ears are lopsided, and it is just driving me crazy now. So, um, yeah, but other than that, I thought this drawing came out pretty good. I did a lot of little cross hatchy details to make it look like uh, there's stuff reflecting off of his, the, his metal skin. So uh, it didn't take me too long to do the pencils. This wasn't too much of an elaborate drawing. So you know, right right now I'm just going straight into inks. Uh, like my last uh, video, my Admiral Thrawn video, this isn't going to be a too long of a video. So and it's coming in here, putting in some details, doing my contours, my outlines. And then uh, once you get into it and I actually get to start doing the cross hatching and everything, that's when stuff like that gets, it gets pretty fun. I, I like doing little details like that. So I'm not great at drawing metal skin. It, it's not really uh, something that I, I, I do a lot. So I, I'm practicing at it more and more, mainly because I've got to still ink the Terminators on my uh, Terminator, Alien vs. Predator vs. Terminator vs. Robocop drawing. Uh, you can check out the pencils for that, the penciling video for that that I have up on this channel. But so this 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 drawing was was good practice for that because you know, as you know the Terminators are, are made of metal and it also good practice for you know drawing RoboCop. So now I'm just coming in. I'm laying in the uh, Copa colors. I, I try to leave a lot of white spaces open to make it look reflective when doing the coloring. And what I figured out when you're coloring the metal skin, I figured out that less is more. So I, I, I feel like next time I'm going to use like less, less colors and just leave more of it white because it gives it more of a metallic look. I think like right there, I think that if I just would add just a little bit more, I would have been fine. Instead, I went over it with a, a lot more colors on his skin. So. Just laying in some more highlights. And I'm doing a background kind of fade on him. Yeah, those ears, they're bothering me so much. And then that's something that really didn't come out as well as I thought it would. It would have to do uh, little highlights. But it is what it is. I think it came out pretty well. My friend liked it, so... Uh, that's good. And here's my finished drawing. Uh, this was pretty fun to do. I, I like. I want to start drawing more. Good practice. I made sure that I left the the lines on his face more to the side to look like there's something at the edge reflecting off of his metal skin. So, um, yeah. If uh, I want to thank you guys for watching, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you like what you see. If you would like to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or any of my social medias, the links are all in the description below. Check my website if you would like to purchase any art or any commissions. I'm always taking commissions, and uh, feel free to comment you know, or, you know, any suggestions of what you'd like me to draw, critique that. I am, would be happy to hear it. So I want to say thanks for watching, guys, and take care.